Hey, what's going on guys? Trump here and today we're gonna be taking a break from the mortuary assistant for a little bit. Uh today as you can see we I am back to playing Genshin. I have been playing it in my spare time actually, but I decided uh why not now be a good time to actually show you what I've been up to. I know I took a break, but I came back as soon as uh about a week after Sumeru came out maybe. Or a week and a half. I got Tainari, or Tignari, I'm sorry, I don't know how to pronounce his name. Uh, I have given him, I've, he's level 80 right now. Nowhere near level 90. He has 816. I'm hoping to level this up a bit more. I don't know if I'm going to crown him, but I'll definitely bring this to 9, this one to 9 as well. Um, I'm having a lot of, I know he's not the best DPS out there, but I, I am having like, a lot, a lot of fun with his character. As for artifact, I have the Wanderer's Troop set on him. It's the easiest one to get. I don't have the best artifact as well on him. Uh, as you can see here, I have plus 20.4 de defense, which could have definitely been better. Oh. Now, in, in general, this would be better. Probably. Actually, no, this is still better. Anyways, moving, moving on. For my feather, we have this. Wow, that is bad. Why did I choose this one? Wait. Oh, I know now why I didn't choose that one. Now, the reason why I chose the crit rate over the 10.9% crit damage is simply because I needed uh, just a little bit more crit rate uh, to shoot over the, you know, get a higher bit of crit rate so that I could equip a crit damage goblet on him. Not goblet. Uh, helmet. Headpiece. Whatever it's called. Now my sands, this is also not that good. I need to get better stuff. Wow, I have really bad artifacts now that I'm looking at it, you know? Okay. Now the- Wow, that's a really, really bad dendro cup. Do I not have anything better? <laughs> uh, well, as you can see, he is definitely not at his full potential. And I don't think he will be for a while. <laughs> even my crit damage hat is not even the best here. But it's good enough, if I'm being honest. I just needed to slap on a set of them. I also gave him Skyward Heart because that's my only 5-star bow. Actually, no, that's my only 5-star like weapon. Now, the team comp I have with him is uh, official. Zhongli and Kaidehara Kazuha. Um, I... If I had Ye Miko, I'd probably replace Fischl with Ye Miko, but either way, uh, Fischl is a very, very good car character. Very, very strong oh, character. I did not mean to go into the map. Now, for Fischl, I don't think I have a proper build with Fischl. Uh, she's only level 70. Because right now, she's my, my only use with her is to proc spread with Dainari. Uh, the Stringless, I have that on her. Artifact, I just have a 4-piece Thunder Suitor, which... I should probably actually have either the new set or Thundering Fury on her. She is C6. Her being C6, I should probably, I should probably you know, build her properly. Uh, 3, 8, 5. Wow. Okay. Kazuha, as I'm sure a lot of you know, my Kazuha is max level with 895 elemental mastery. Why is my elemental mastery so low? I have, I'm pretty sure I have like a full EM. Okay, well, no, it's still low because this is still purple. I don't think I've, I'm gonna get like a very des a very decent, uh, yeah, I'm not. Do I have like an elemental ma- another... No. No, I don't. Never mind. Okay, anyways. Constellation 3. I'm not sure if I showed this to you guys actually. No, Constellation 2, what am I saying? 
Constellation 2, which is actually what I really, really wanted. So I'm happy I got the uh, Constellation 2 from Kazuha and I got really lucky there. For his talent, of course, I have 10, 10, 9. I want to crown this. Should I crown this right now? I might, because Kazuha is without a doubt my favorite uh, character in the game so far. So I might actually crown this. Strongly, we have a 2 piece, no bless, 2 piece, okay, Petra. Uh, no constellations and 299. I might crown this as well, but for now, I think I might. I'm gonna, you know, on this video, I'm gonna crown Kazuo Kazu Slap real quick. Let's go somewhere. So, I'm gonna basically, I'm trying to show what I've been up to since I start last stopped. I stopped. In the middle of the new islands, the Golden Apple Ar Archipelago, in the middle of that. And I came back around yeah, a week and a half after Sumeru came out. Uh, I'm done with the Archon quest, but I have not started this quest at all. I know it's a very, very important quest, and it's very, very, like, you know, big. Um, basically, as big as the... um the Archon quest, but right now I've been I'm too lazy and I don't want to burn myself out again, especially since with upcoming characters, there is somebody I am really, really waiting for. Which prob probably means I probably should not have pulled for Tainari, but you know what? It is what it is. Kazuha Slash! This is not worth it, by the way this much materials for this but i love kazuha too much to not do it <laughs> anyways so we're gonna have a quick damage test against a few enemies first enemy we're gonna have a quick damage test against is the jade plume terror shroom and the next one will be masanori because masanori is just the the one puppet everybody wants to beat up My big problem with Dainari is without spread, he is completely, completely useless. He he has very, very low damage, and I don't know if it's just my stats or what, but his damage is very, very, very underwhelming. And I don't like how long he takes with his charge shot if it's not from his E, from his elemental skill. We'll just move along here. Skip. Don't mind me there. The reason why I'm using Zhongli is, of course, for the shield. And, uh, of course, is Dendro Res. Elemental Res and physical res of opponents in a small AoE by 20%. See? We're gonna go ahead. Gather. Now, I don't actually... I know people take... Kill this boss like very very fast, but I don't because I've been using Tainari and due to that I don't do as much damage as I I'm not, my Tainari is not like perfect, I know that, I've, there's a lot more I need to do with him. Solidify! Can't see, I heal everything! Wow, thanks for not critting me. Gather! Oh, it's for me! In crowd! But you know, it, it, it is what it is, right? No, wow, okay, thanks for that. Right now, Tainari is in a weird spot in the community. People think he's very, very weak. Uh, but there are also some people that say he's very good, especially for single target damage. That, that is his main focus. Is that His main focus is definitely single target damage. And, you know, you know, like, a lot of the game, there's, you know, a lot of, uh, I don't know why I can't talk. In a lot of the game, there's usually going to be a lot of enemies. So him being just single target becomes a problem to a lot of many people. 
uh, especially in the Spiral Abyss, where there's just groups and groups, and people are probably would probably think, why not? Why would you not just choose someone like Ganyu? Well, I don't have Ganyu. I probably should have pulled for Ganyu instead of Tainari, considering that Tainari will be uh, in the standard banner after. What's but him being in the standard banner also, I don't know, I probably shouldn't have pulled for him. Do I regret it? This is order. Not entirely. By no, I'm having fun with him. Right now, I'm the most fun I'm having with him. Next to Kaiba, of course. One with the forest. Let's nip that in the butt. But I'm not completely underwhelmed with his damage. Especially considering that he's not even like max level yet. As you, oh, wow, I got smacked by that. I'm dealing like, what, 12,000 on the first one, and that's with spread. It's not the best, I'll admit that. But it happens very quickly, and there's other extra instances of damage that happen alongside it. But. We'll do this again, actually. Let's not be too confusing about it. We'll try and just use... We'll try and use less of... Kazuha, which is gonna be hard because I love Kazuha too much. What's We'll do this slowly. Solidify! Take this! One with the forest! I hear everything! Okay, I saw like 9,000 and 10,000 there. 12,000, 9,000, 12,000, 11,000. Okay, that didn't crit. Okay, that didn't crit, but that wasn't even my ability. 12,000, 2,000. So spread can crit. That was something I was never sure of, that, but it can. Keep Another up. problem with spread is that I am pretty sure it isn't multiplicative, it's uh, additive, the damage. So, same with aggravate, which I really wish they could have changed to make it multiplicative. Solidify. Of additive. If you don't know what that is, uh, let me explain that real quick. If you don't know what the difference between those two is when, when it comes to Genshin Impact is, when you say multiplicative, it's like the percentages and you get an artifacts, you get an... You get an uh, five percent attack bonus. That's five percent of your attack, more. But if it's five attack, then that's let's say you have a thousand attack, that becomes a thousand and five. Uh, you get what I mean? Uh, okay, let's say I were to deal two thousand damage, right? Aggravate would instead, if I were to cause aggravate let's say it has a flat damage buff of 2000 right an extra 2000 and more elemental master you have the higher that goes so let's say if i had no elemental master and i caused aggravate my damage would go from 2000 to 4000 because of that flat 2000 that aggra aggravate has if i add more elemental mastery on it let's say it goes higher that flat at buff goes higher let's say it goes to 5000 my 2000 attack will then cause aggravate additive damage of 5000 including elemental mastery to add on to what i have instead of removing com totally removing that flat um damage buff and instead using the multiplicative numbers from elemental mastery onto my actual attack if i were to have let's say uh a hundred percent right extra damage from elemental mastery for aggravate 2000 then that 100 percent you then get technically a high a way higher number than you would and it, it was very confusing it's a very confusing thing to explain but i'm i'm i'm, I'm sure that you know you you understand that a lot of you are I can't see. I'll uproot you. I wish that spread wasn't like additive and it says multiplicative. That because that might wow, I missed. That then might help with a few of Tainari's damage problem. But yeah, without uh aggravate as you saw, or without spread as you saw. My damage with Tainari is not the best. If I can crit, 
Critting with the with one of the after shots is two thousand. Can I stop missing? Critting with the first shot. Oh no. On, reveal thyself. But yeah, you get what I mean. It, it, it's a it's a whole mess of math and um like math and just a lot of thinking that you know you don't really have to do. Will I try pulling for Ganyu? Maybe. Ganyu is overpowered. Uh, but I don't know. I'm definitely waiting for a certain character in 3.1 that I feel like might be releasing already thanks to some uh, not at all possible leaks that I saw. Because if he, if he or she is coming out in 3.1, I definitely want him or her without a doubt. Um, but <laughs> anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Those were my thoughts on Dainari and how spread and aggravate work. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.